I got a new tripod and it's big. Let me show you. There are a thousand different tripods and it's very hard to choose the right one. So here is one more. I got it from Milibu and they wanted me to test this one. Maybe this can help you choose the right one in your future. Milibu did send this tripod to me for free, but I am not being paid to say anything special about this product. The product is called Milibu MTT 605A and it's one of their bigger tripods. The price is 268 US dollars on B&H and it comes in a very nice carrying case. Included you'll get the tripod feet, you get a fluid head, you get a base plate and their bolt tightening coin. The total weight of this product is 2.9 kilograms and the maximum load bearing is 10 kilos which is the size of a red camera body. It is built of a mix between aluminium and hard plastic and it has a storage height of 80 centimeters and it can reach all the way up to 170 centimeters and go down to 50 centimeters, which is a huge range. This is much lower than my other tripod and it provides me to make some really interesting camera shots from a much lower angle. All the adjustments can be done with, with these single flip locks. To adjust to the lowest settings, you need to correct the ground spaces right here, which you can do with three finger screws. It is not the easiest thing to go from fully extended mode to completely collapsed. It is a little bit time consuming if you want to do all of them at the same time. This part is the most fragile as I see it and I would like to see a better and a little higher quality in the future. And while we're down here let's talk about the spike shoes because you have the option of getting spike shoes but this rubber part is a little bit too tight uh, to remove but when you've done that you have some spike feet that really can settle into the ground. I don't think I will be using this that often, but uh, when I need it, it's very nice that the option is there. It comes with a very smooth fluid head and it has a feature to level the camera base by turning this knob below here. The motion is very smooth and it's very easy to operate, but you don't have any adjustments of how smooth the fluid motion is. The fluid head uses a standard Manfrotto 501 plate and it has a really cool quick feature quick locking feature. You simply just align it and then press it in. Tighten this knob over here and it's that as simple as that. If the camera position are balanced with the fluid head, it will return back to its original stop position using the tilt function. If you like the Milibu brand, please check out my previous video on one of their monopods in the cards up here or in the description down below. I hope you enjoyed my review of this Milibu MTT 605A tripod. And if you have any comments, please leave them down below and consider subscribing and I will see you in the future.